Hi, good people, and welcome to another one of my traffic methods by one in 20. Okay, now what's going to be really good, really good about this is I'm going to be showing you um, a new software which you can start using this and also how you can build a system where using certain things all right it sounds a little bit obscure it sounds a bit weird but don't worry uh, i'm going to go more into it okay so what we're going to do with this is i'm going to introduce you to the new google chatbot okay it's called bard now we're going to use bard now i'm going to shrink the screen down and we're going to jump straight into this i'm just going to give you a little bit of a demonstration you can see that i'm into forex okay um and i was having a little bit of a toy of an idea and i thought oh i wonder if there's any way i could convert metro trader 4 into metro trader 5 now the reason you might want to do this is because you can use an offline account and you could test certain um certain things okay but not necessarily because you're using a metro trader 5 which is a better testing system than metro trader 4 okay so you might think well how can i convert that for it to work onto metro trader 4 if you're using that okay so I'm just going to demonstrate how easy it is what you basically do is you just put please write me an article about um how to change mt4 to mt5 okay now we're going to hit enter what it's going to do is this is going to spin it's going to look on the internet and it's going to go and work out um very quickly a way of how i can convert mt4 data into mt5 okay and you can see that it's had no problem whatsoever doing that now what you're going to do is you're going to click on here and you're going to put please can you create a um um create a code for my blank find it hard to spell at the moment for my blank website and add a download button after you have finished to convert mt5 to mt4 okay now we're gonna hit enter and what it's gonna do now is it's gonna write a code okay and it's just super clever stuff because what you can see please can you create a code for my blank um code you can use to create a website converts mt4 to mt5 okay and then what you would do now is you just copy and paste this all right this code all this code and then you would pop this into your website using um your html button okay and, or you would use your um you, well you have like a little thing i'm going to go into it anyway so you're going to know exactly what i'm doing i just wanted to show you um just how really good bard is but what i'm going to be doing this isn't the traffic method which i'm going to be showing you the traffic med method that i'm going to be showing you is this if we go online okay and say we go to google and we go to google.com okay and then what we're going to do is we're going to work out whether or not because my idea of the demonstration is sort of showing you mt4 converted to mt5 okay now i'm going to be showing you how we can work say for instance pdf two and if you notice when as soon as i come up with this it's going to say word word converter jpeg xl ping ppt xl converter image jpeg converter okay so these are the most um searched words with inside this perimeter okay for pdf so if we change this now to ping okay ping two and you'll see that ping there's nothing on ping okay but if we put jpeg 
and you'll see JPEG to PDF, JPEG to ping, JPEG to convert to Word, JPEG to PDF converter, SVG, okay, JPEG, WebP, ICO. So you can see how this is working. Now, what you might be asking is, how can you convert this into money, right? Well, there's already people out there that are searching for that. Now, how are you going to know how people are searching for this, right? Well, the first thing you can do is go to similar web. So we go to similar web. Okay, we're we'll going to click on here. We're going to open up similar web. And we're going to analyze a website. Okay, so the way that you can do this is if we go here and if we put PDF to JPEG converter. Okay, you can see there's loads coming down here. So if we click on this one. And now we've got this this one here okay if we click on here we're going to copy this link we're going to go back to similar web and we're going to paste it in here and then we're going to do a search and what it's going to do it's going to search and it's going to show us how many visitors that this actual site gets so pdfsimply.com you can see that the total visits 5.5 million Pages per visit, 4.33, okay. Global, 9,801. Category, 51. So, you know, it's giving us a good idea, and this is just going up and up and up, okay. So it's showing us that it's number 51 in a similar rank site, okay. So we could actually see if we can find another one like that, but what I'm trying to show you is we've got 5.5 million visits, okay. And this is for um, someone that just wants to convert PDF to JPEG, okay? Because that's what this is. This is a free PDF to JPEG converter. So how you can start making money, okay, is you can create a converter. Now, how we're going to create a converter is, see, look, it shows you also how much money they make in a year. It says the annual revenue is 1 million to 2 million a year, okay? That's how much money they're making with inside this system. Okay, so just by using this, this is siphoning the traffic that's coming in to people that are looking for a PDF to JPEG converter. Okay, so I'm going to show you how you can do this. I can't guarantee that you can make that much money. Okay, no one can. Uh, but what I can do is I can show you a system that may be able to build up your emails very, very fast, may be able to bring you sales. Okay. Uh, and it's and I'm going to show you this and how and how we're going to do this. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to use um, a keyword. Now there's loads and loads of keywords out there. Okay, there a lot of them are expensive to use. So I'm going to bypass that by giving you a way of how you can use a keyword for free. Okay, and I'm using this one here, which is Google Ads Keyword Planner, uh, because if you've got a Google account. <clears throat> you can actually use this okay all you need to do is type in google ads keyword planner set it all up etc and then you're good okay you're good to go now it says here discover new keywords so if we click on this new keyword and if we type in here okay say jpeg to ping converter okay now we're going to hit get results well, it's going to give us a list of certain things here, okay? And then it's also going to give us uh, a bid, all right? And then it's going to give us a competition. So at the moment, JPEG to PIN converter is a low. It's got a low competition. So the average monthly searches is only 10 to 100, okay? So we're going to avoid that because that's not, not what we need. This one, however, is completely different because it's PIN to JPEG converter, is 1,000 to 10,000 views per month, right? This is still low, so it's a low competition. So we could use this particular keyword, okay? So we can copy this keyword. And what we're gonna do is we're just gonna to go to documents and I'm just gonna create a keyword list, okay? I'm gonna use a text document. I'm just gonna put um, converter keyword list we're going to open this up and we're going to paste this in 
Okay, so that's the first one, right? And I'm just going to save it just in case the computer crashes. Okay, so the next one I'm going to do is we're going to scroll through. And you see that there's not much going on here, okay? But what it does do is it gives you here, it gives you ideas. So JPEG to Docs Converse. So if we click on this link and now get results, now we've got Convert to JPEG to PIN. We've got Doc. So JPEG to PIN, Convert, JPEG to Doc. It's only 0 to 10 searches, so that's really not going to work, is it? So what we do is you have a look and, and see if you've got anything else that you can see. Okay, so you may, for instance, might want to change an MP4 file to an MP3 file, right? So we'll try that. So the way you can do this is you can either come out of this by clicking on this and go back to your discover new keywords and start again. So now you could put MP4 to MP3 and now do a search. Okay, now this one comes up with convert MP4 to MP3, 1,000, 10,000 to 100,000 searches. That's 100,000 people in one month. Okay, so this is really good. This is convert MP4 to MP3. Okay, so we're going to copy that. Copy that. And we're going to paste this into our converter. And these are keywords which are carrying traffic, okay? Now, what we might want to do, see, look, MP4 to audio file, okay? So let's click on that. And let's do another search. And MP4 to audio file is 10 to 100, so that's no good. YT to MP4, look at that's YouTube to MP4 is 10,000 so that's not bad 1,000 to 10,000 so you're looking really for the highest ones okay so YouTube to mp4 is 100k to 1 million so this is really good it says that the competition is low okay so this is a really good one to go for so we're going to copy this one and we're going to paste this into our converter Okay, so we're going to use these three, all right? And we're going to save that. Now, there's just one thing I want to do is I just want to just type in here. Um, I just want to put uh, MP4 to MP3 converter now the only reason I'm doing this is because this might be the very thing that I'm going to use this keyword so I want to see if there's a competition if other people are using this okay now let's hit get results and you'll see that with this mp3 to mp mp4 to mp3 converter I'm still getting 1,000 to 10,000 views every single month okay so this is a real good one to go for right so I'm going to copy that this one here I want to copy. Because I want to use that, okay? I want to use this. Because this is a very low, but very good chance of getting a lot of traffic from it. So we're going to go back here. And we're going to paste this in. Okay, so MP4 to MP3 converter free. Okay, so this has got a really good chance of taking off because it's already showing it was really, really high. It's a very, very high. So if we go here, it was 1 million, which was excellent. You know, if we've got something that's, that's really going to work well, 1 million is going to work really, really well. Now, what I could have done really is I should have put down what these are but i do know that i'm going to get traffic from this so the next thing you're going to do is you're going to head over to bard okay and we're just going to reset the chat and then i'm going to use the copier this is my converter okay so i'm going to use this one first because i really think i found something here with this one okay and i'm going to put 
please can you write me a small article about and then paste that in and all I'm doing is just getting a feeler of how this is going to react <clears throat> and we're going to see what it comes up with so it says I'm designed solely to process and generate text so I'm unable to assist you with that okay so it's telling me that it can't write uh, a small oh okay I'll tell you why if I change it if I put please can you write me a small article about mp3 and mp4 converter and now if it, without the free you'll find it'll probably be all right he didn't like the free bit so let's just see if he does what it's supposed to do here we go so it's wrote that okay so here look what is mp3 and mp4 converter so we've got lots and lots of things we can do here, right? Because the first thing we could do if we wanted to is we can create a blog. We could create um, a domain which has got MP4 to MP3 converter in it if we wanted to because there is a keyword that people are searching for, right? So that's the first thing we can do. We could also write it as uh, an, in an instrument. We could write it. We, we could put it into Medium. We could put it into a WordPress uh, or we could actually put it out there um, so we can actually put it if we put it out as a domain it's then going to rank with inside Google and eventually we are going to get people that are going to come towards this page that we've made right so you know that's the first thing that we could do now the way you could do that <clears throat> without using a domain is you could copy this okay so what is an mp3 converter copy okay and then what we're going to do is we're going to go over to google docs which is here and then we're going to click on google docs and we're going to create blank okay so we're now going to create a blank document And then what we're going to do is we're going to headline it, okay? So our headline is going to be our keyword, right? So if we go back to converter, which was this one here, copy that, and pop this over here like that, paste without full main. Actually, I'll tell you what we need to do. We need to... Um, We'll paste without okay and then i'm going to highlight and then i'm going to change this to a heading and i want it to be heading one okay now heading one is going to be it's going to be easier for google to pick it up all right so we're going to click on heading one okay so that's now opened that up now what we're going to do is we're going to paste in uh information okay so if we go here back to our bard we're going to copy this because this was all of our information that we've got this is a small article of our information and then what we're going to do is we are going to go back to our google doc which is this one here and i'm going to paste this in like so okay right the next thing we're going to do is we're going to copy this and paste that in here all right so now if anyone's searching for mp4 to mp3 converter it's going to bring up okay mp4 to mp3 converter okay now the methods in the madness all right because the idea is that you advertise this with this link on google docs all right so people are going to be looking for this and then what we need to do is we just need to put in here um we we just need to take it to a website and that website is going to be a converter okay so our mp4 to mp3 converter now the idea of doing this is that i use builder role so it just means that i can have my builder role link right down here 
and it will take them to it. If you're using WordPress, you'll be able to take them to it. If you're using ClickFunnels, you'll be able to take them to it. If you want to use an Aweber link, you can take them to it. If you want to use a Git response link, you can take them to it. If you want to use Medium, completely free, you can take them to it. If you want to use Tumblr, you can take them to it, okay? And this way you can actually do that, okay? So there's lots and lots of things that you can use. You do not have to use what I'm using. I'm showing you how you can universally do this, okay? So what we're gonna do now is for my own peace of mind, I'm gonna be using my own software, okay? Why not, right? I pay for it every single month, I might as well use it. So I'm gonna to go to my builder role, okay? So I'm just looking to see if my builder role is already open. Uh, so I need to go here and I need to open up my builder roll. Builder roll. You know. Uh, I just need to find it. There we go. We'll go to sign in. And it should remember me. Now I should be able to sign in. So I'll click on here and sign in. Okay, so I'm inside my builder role, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to create, let's go back, dashboard. That's definitely not what I had in mind. What's going on here? Let's come out of that. Let's go here. Should be bad now it's because uh, build role has been updated to build role six so that's the very reason at the moment why there's lots and lots of things going on here okay this is my build role website builder okay it's really really fast so i'm going to click on here's enter and i'm going to create um my thing right i'm going to show you how i do this now remember you can do this on anything all right you can actually use if you wanted to uh google um sites Google dot sites. Okay, that's completely free as well. Um, and there is um, a team you can use, and also there is um, a cam. There, there's loads of other portfolio you can use, which works quite well as well. Okay, but for the time being, I'm going to be introducing. I'm just going to show you how we're going to do it with this. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to click on create new site. I'm going to choose a professional t template, and then I'm going to choose a blank template. Okay. So I'm going to use a blank. Oh, didn't want to do preview. Hang on. Let's go back. We're going to select blank and save. Okay, so now what it's going to do, it's going to open up this page like so. Okay, so what we we'll do now is I'm going to name it. Okay, so we're going to skip tour because I don't need a tour. And I'm going to put settings. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to change my home. All right, and I'm going to control V mp4 to mp3 converter 3 right because if this meter tag picks up with inside google i can get traffic from it all right now i am not running it through a domain because i'm using it through my google doc which is going to already be on google which i'm going to show you how to do that right so all we need to do now is mp4 dash two dash mp3 dash converter dash free okay so that's that and then what i wanted to do if i wanted to draw a picture or something like that i can do quickly okay if i go into here canva um let's have a look let's see if we can do so quick let's use this one Gonna get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, right? And then what I could do is put I could put it's MP four to MP three. converter free 
Now there's a reason why you do this, okay? Because believe it or not, there is an optical eye within inside the um, algorithm of Google, right? So if I was say, for instance, going to pop this on YouTube, I might be able to skim some traffic from it because MP4 to MP3 converter free is already driving 10,000 to um, 100,000 people clicking for this link okay so this is a good chance i might be able to drive traffic from that okay so you know and what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna go here i'm just gonna put mp4 to mp3 image i'm just gonna grab an image if we go here perfect see this one here perfect okay so we're going to grab this one so all i want to do with this is i just want to click on here just want to grab that save as mp4 to mp3 converter three and why have i done that well because if the algorithm's searching for it and it sees it it's going to see it in the picture it's a good chance that I might be able to use that, okay? All right, so what we're gonna do now, it's gonna go back to Canva, and we're going to put this in the background. So if I go to here, upload, I'm gonna grab quick access, grab that, bring that on there like that. drag that across and then I can bring that down like that that needs to be changed okay so we're just going to change this a bit I'm going to do red I'm going to use an effect grab that and I'm going to make that white okay that would do that would do mp4 to mp3 converter 3 okay so we've done that All right so we're going to click on here to save it the same thing mp4 to mp3 converter 3 i'm going to save this in a ping format and a jpeg format that's one back to there jpeg download Okay, so that's that. So what we're going to do now is we are going to transfer this into my site, okay? So, which is this one here, all right? So I'm just going to put it, pop it in here. So when someone clicks that, it's going to come up at the top here. That's the idea, all right? So we're going to select. And also, it's already got the wording on it that I, that I require. So we're going to see, hopefully, there it is. And we're going to use the JPEG. Chuck that in there like that. Click on that and then add save. So that's it, all right? Now, it doesn't matter too much about that it's wrong size and everything else. It doesn't matter because it's already got MP4 to MP3 on it, right? Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to hit save. Okay, so we've done that, right? Now we're gonna hit edit page. Now this just takes us into our builder. Okay, now we're gonna build it. And what we're gonna do with this? Well, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna use some of the SEO that we already put down with inside this, okay? So let's just get rid of this for now. Or actually we could use this actually. We'll get rid of it. Okay, so that's gone. Okay, skip tour. I'm gonna get rid of this as well. And I'm going to get rid of this as well. Okay, now I'm going to go over, I'm going to look for panel. I'm going to create a blank panel. Okay, so I've got something to work with now. Okay, now first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to my MP4, which is this one here. Copy this, and I'm going to paste this in here like so. Control V. Okay, so we got that right. Next thing I'm going to do just going to add a picture right elements 
image. We're going to grab that one. Pop that up there like that. Click on there. Click on there. Go add the picture. This one here, okay. Now I'm going to bring this page up. Bring it up like that. I'm going to center it. So I'm going to click on here and it will center it. Click on here. And I'm going to center this. Okay, so we're getting there, right? Now I'm going to open this up. Like so. Right, now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to add in what I need to add in, which you will need to add in as well. So go to Elements. I'm going to add in here, okay? And this is called, if I can see it, iframe. I'm going to chuck an iframe in here, okay? So what we can do is we're going to click on this. I'm going to grab the iframe. I'm going to put the iframe in here. Now, if I bring that iframe down like that, it allows me to open the box even more, right? Now I can go back, center it. Like so. Right, now we've done that side, right? So we've now got the site, it's all ready to go. The next step we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to Bard. Okay, and what we're gonna do now is we're gonna ask Bard to convert, encode, our converter, all right? So how we do this is we tell it how we want the actual code to be written, right? So very easy. All we need to do is put create a code for my blank website to add and it's mp4 to mp3 converter with a download button so with a download button okay so people can download the new converted file okay now we're going to hit enter what it's going to do is now we're going to write the code right so it's now writing this code the code's completely done so what we're going to do now is we're going to there's two ways you can do this you can either hover across here drag across and grab it all okay or you for the convenience Bard has allowed you to copy code. So it's copy code, it's come up down here. Then you're going to go back to your site. And again, this is going to be different because if it's in your WordPress, you're going to have to um, grab your HTML um, coding and then you'd put it inside your header. Okay. With Builderall, the way I do it is I use uh, this way by using an iframe, okay, which is my way of putting my HTML in. So all I do now is I click on this edit element, general settings, and then embed doc, and I need to right mouse click, paste text in and apply. Okay, and now if we scroll this down like so, you'll see that we've got MP4 to MP3 converter, okay? choose file convert right so what you do now is if you've got an mp4 you put the mp4 into here all right then hit choose file and it's going to convert it into an mp3 right so first thing we need to do is save it that's fine okay so go to website That's going to open up this page so you'll see now that this is working all right so we've got uh, newsflash mp4 to mp3 converter free mp4 converter free mp4 to mp3 converter okay so choose file right so if we click on this file it's now opened up my own windows if i search for an mp4 
and just do a search for now to see if anything comes up. We want a small, if we can, we want to find a small video, right? A lot of these are all quite big. This one here, look. Okay, so accessing tree, traffic tree link. Okay, so let's click on here and open. It's accessing tree. Now we're going to hit convert. Oh, it says the entity is too large. So all that is because it's 64. Okay, that's the reason why it's just too big. But you get the gist of what you do, right? You allow this to convert. So say, for instance, MP4. Okay, so the way you can do this is if we go to Tenor. Enter. <clears throat> and we got here Tenor. Okay. And if we click on any of these, so this one here. You'll see that MP4 is here. So if I click on MP4, right mouse click, save video as, and I'm going to put not funny, and now I'm going to hit save. Okay, so I've downloaded that not funny MP4. If I now go back to here, I'm going to refresh this page so it gets rid of this. I'm going to choose the file. So I'm now going to choose not funny. Click on here, open, and now I'm going to hit convert. Why don't you find the file? Let's go back. Let's do that again. Choose file. Download. Open, convert. Okay, well you get the idea, all right? MP4 to MP3, convert a three. It, I'm just showing you what, what, what you do, all right? So the reason why this is not working is because it can't find my string, okay? It's because I need to create an MP4 folder, all right? So that's the reason why I can't find it. But um, for the entertainment person, you, give, you get an idea of what you do. Now, once you've created your MP4 to your MP3 converter, okay, you could have always, if you find that BARD doesn't work, you can use ChatGPT. If you go to ChatGPT. So if we go open, open ChatGPT, click on there. Login, sign in with Google. I always sign in with Google. I think it works better. Sign in with that. Okay. What's going on here? Okay, so we're inside here. Okay, so what we need to do, you can see that these are all the ones that I've used before. So we use new chat. We're going to put, please, can you create um, a code for my blank website to add MP4 to MP three converter with a download button so people can download the new converted file. Okay. So we've got that. I'm just got to just change the Make sure we've got no spelling mistakes. Go. What it's going to do is going to certainly, here we go, it's creating the HTML as we speak. And all I'm going to do, I'm going to copy this converted file once it's done into my other file. Okay. 
There's a download link. So we'll only do all his stuff. Okay, it's just wind it all out. So it's telling me a few things that I need to do. There's a couple of things that I probably need to do for the conversion file, but it will be enough to get me going. Okay, so I'm just going to click on this. Go all the way down to the bottom. Right mouse click, copy. Right, we're going to head over to here. Okay, so if we click on here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this just for the time being. And I'm going to, I'm going to copy this. Just going to scroll that down to about here. I'm just going to open this up, bring that down. And the reason I've done this is so I can just keep both of them there at the moment. All right. And then I'm going to click on here, click on there. And I'm going to change the embed code with inside here. Control V. And then I'm going to hit apply. And now I'm going to save. And I'm going to see if that works. That's fine. Go to website. So we're opening it up. Okay, so that's done. Okay, so it says choose files. We're going to click on here. Now, of course, we know that this one ain't going to work because this is the one that wasn't working. So we're going to use this one here. Okay, so I'm going to click on here. I'm going to click on there, open that up. And now I'm going to put convert to MP3. Conversion file, please try again. Okay. Now the reason why, as I said to you before, that is because there's a little bit of a glitch. But if you was converting this to, say, something else, it's going to work, okay? But you get the gist, you get the idea of what you do, okay? Because we're using this high-powered word. What you could also do, okay, is you could have a link piggy bank to this, okay? So what you could do is you could take this out. I'll show you how to do this. Close this. You're going to get rid of this, okay? Um, yeah, get rid of this. Yes, delete. What we're going to do is we're going to search MP4 to MP3 converter download okay and you see here mp3 quick install easy to use converter free convert mp4 to mp3 so we, what we can do is we're going to click on this mp4 to converter so this is already good to go right so copy this this is if you have any diehard problems this is what else you can do okay and then what you want to do now is go back in here What we're going to do is we're going to create a button. So I'm going to go here. Go, click on here. Text. And you put, if any problems, Please, oh God, I can't spell today. Please use this link as an alternative. Because it's free, right? It's not, you're not going to get any problem with this, okay? So what you've done is you've covered your back, just in case you do get a problem with this that isn't working. If any problems, please use this link as an alternative, okay? And then what you do is you add a button in. button here I'm going to grab this this will do pop the button in here I'm going to click on here and we're going to paste the URL plain select I'm going to change that headline convert your file here okay now there's a couple of other things you could do with this right 
I'm just going to save it. I'm just going to show you it works. Because what you could do is you could have a landing page here and you could collect their email. So it would say, hi, just quickly, can you just add your email and such and such? And you could capture their email. Okay, so this is another way which you can do. Um, because what you're doing basically is people are going to look into this mp4 to mp3 converter for free okay if any problems please use this link as an alternative so they click on here it's taking them to the file if we click on choose file we'll just check to make sure it's working let's click on that open now we click convert you see it's completely converted out link tool all done and dusted okay so you can see conversion results all done and it's come up with an error again but it, it still you can still download it okay convert your file automatically deleted after four hours okay so you can see that it, it works okay <laughs> right so if we go back here now what you do now okay is this one here we go back close this we want to close this and we want to close this close this and we want to go to here okay now what we do is click on here copy go to website pop up here copy the website okay now this will be your slug if you're in wordpress okay so you'll be using exactly the same thing and then what you want to do then is you want to go to your google doc and you want to put a hyperlink okay check out this great free tool here right control v okay so i've put my link in now obviously you would use uh something to get rid of that link okay because it looks a bit messy so what you could do is put click me now okay and then we're going to just hyperlink that go to here go to the insert link paste the link and apply okay so now when anyone clicks on this what we're going to do is we're going to share share this document oh i've got to show you what we'll do actually um what you've got to do now is we want to go to file um download a share here we go right so we're going to go to share publish to web okay so what we're doing is we're publishing this to web make your content visible to anyone publishing on the web you can link or embed your document okay so we're going to put publish and then get okay and now we've got this link okay so we're going to copy this link now if we want to we can twitter this link it's going to bring up this link here and we're going to tweet it so that's done uh we can put on facebook so we can go to facebook you can see the power already what you can do with this right go to group we're going to type in affiliate marketing worldwide And then what we're going to do is we're going to grab some information, right? Now, there's two ways you can do it. We can either go back here or if we use Bard. Scroll up. Grab this. Copy. And we want to go back to our here. Paste that in. Like so. Okay. Now here. Paste it to Facebook and this is now gone on Facebook with the link okay now what's good about this is because it's not an affiliate link it will be allowed to be shown on Facebook okay you're not gonna have a problem with that and also you've published this now what you really need to do and if you watch one of my other videos which I did about SEO WordPress you really need to put some headers in here um, and you need to break this down a little bit because it make it easier for people to be able to pick this up okay which is on this one here because at the moment if you look 
So if we copy this link for now, copy this link, okay. Close it, go back to converter, paste that link, save it, okay. And then what you do is you do it all over again with YouTube to MP4, convert to MP4 to MP3, ping to JPEG to converter. Now, when you went into this file, okay, where see this it needs to be broken down, it needs to be at least two to three words. Otherwise, it's going to be really hard for, um, and it's got to have headlights, head headings, and stuff like that. So there's lots and lots of work that needs to be done to this. It makes it more readable, okay? Because you want it to be more readable. Because if uh, there's too many boxed up, it needs to have some headlines, and you need to make sure you've got heading three for all that. But it's all within inside the other training, which you should already know about, okay? So the idea of this is just giving you an idea of what you can do. So you've got MP4 to MP3 converter is free. This is now live and published, okay? So this means that anyone that's searching for MP4 to MP3 converter free, okay, it's going to come up with inside this, okay? So, for instance, um, they are going to be able to get access to this, okay? So if we go here, click on the link, Hit enter. It's going to bring up this page. Publish using Google Docs. Okay. And now if they click on this, it's going to give them a redirect notice telling them that it's safe. Okay. Because they're just checking to make sure it's safe. It's then going to bring them up this page here where they can do their MP4 to MP3 converter. If this doesn't work for unforeseen circumstances, you've covered yourself by if any problems, please use this link as an alternative. So they're going to click on this link. It's going to take them to this page now what you do okay is where we have got mp4 to mp3 okay this is obviously to do with sound video stuff like that right so what you do to optimize this page if we go back to here we're going to click on edit page Okay, so we've got this. What you want to do is you want to put a call to action in here, right? Now you can have a call to action landing page, so you capture your email, put them into an email swipe, send the email swipe off five to seven days, okay? And there's a chance that you're going to be able to um, get a sale from that. Now the best way to do this is to use ClickBank, okay? So we're using ClickBank. So what we want to do is we want to do a search and we want to use MP4 and do a search, okay, and see if anything comes up because it's going to be relevant to what we're we are doing. Okay, so it's not very much on there. Let's try MP3. Okay, so what we got here: Genius Brain Power MP3 Audio Package, powerful comprehensive brainwave entertainment system that will make you smarter, relieve stress. Help you achieve incredibly deep meditation, uh, fearless flow conversion system, the unexplainable store, cure insomnia, reprogram, hypnosis. That's not what we're looking for, okay? So what we're looking for is video, right? Video editing. Let's try video editing. So we've got something like this, okay? So video surgeon, AI video creator. So we want to check the gravity, it's 0.98, it's not very good. Gravity 14, it's not very good. Video marketing blaster. 314, anything over 5 is probably a good one. So astrology, no, it's no good. Let's keep researching. A viral video. So the other way you can do it is to go to top offers and type in uh, so look Akira Cortex Postane Glutane Red so this is all health stuff it's not so it's not really working with that okay so what we did is we look on the criteria down here and we're gonna have a look here so we could go music so music music's not on here 
video editing, so video will be a good one. But we've just got to find something that's going to fit what we're trying to do. Okay, so we just need to look. So employment, education, e-business, e-marketing, video marketing. Here we go. Right, so this has got 23.26 turn, text to speech with human like videos, video rank, thumbnail blaster. So, you know, any of these will work. Okay, so thumbnail blaster, for instance, I use this, works really, really well. Um, this would work well. Okay, so we can use this. So, what you need to do is you can just hit affiliate program, and see what it looks like. Okay, I know what this looks like because I already use it. So you could um, click on promote button and then hit create hop link and then you could copy this, okay? Now if you wanted to, you could create your whole website so when they click on it, it opens up a website very, very similar to the sales page um, and copy some of the stuff on the sales page and put it into a landing page and then you can collect their email, okay? So this is another way that you can do this. So we've copied the link just for time because time's getting on this has gone on for a while all i'm going to show you is we're going to put a button in here okay so if we go back here and we're just going to go to add elements just going to grab a button just for argument so we're going to grab this and then we're going to click on here we're going to paste this link in select just going to change this to video blaster and what you want to do is you want to make certain links that are relevant to what your converter is okay so if you was doing like jpeg to ping because that's like images then you could do a painting thing you could do um you know like uh, some form of painting okay or you can use like um, a designing you know stuff like that okay now you're gonna hit save and then the idea is that when people go to the mp4 to mp3 converter or they click on there to use it they're gonna think what's video blaster never seen that before right and then when they click on it you have a chance of someone buying it from you and when you do you get 50% commissions through signing up through Clickbank completely free because these are designed to seduce you okay these are designed to to get you to click on the link and buy it so you're getting a video marketing blaster for 27 dollars right and this is high converting it's going to help you get sales and when you get the sales you're then going to make money online with this and then before you know you could get yourself to 100 to 300 dollars a day just by putting out these converters all right so this is just something I want to show you. Um, it's a really good way, a cool way of doing it. It's completely free. I've shown you how to do this completely free. Just remember that the website that I've shown you is Build Roll, which you do pay for. But remember, I'm only using it because I've already got it and I've already paid for it. Okay. So, you know, there may be a link below for Build Roll if you want to try a 14 day trial. It will be below because um, it, it's really really quick for building stuff extremely quick and anyone who joins with inside builder roll especially if they join builder roll premium uh, i instantly give you three and a half thousand dollars worth of my bonuses for you um because and all my products okay so you get all my products all my landing pages all my sales pages all my bonuses pretty much everything i built on builder roll i send over to you and you can actually convert it change it customize it use it how you want to uh, I even give you my actual product template so you can create your very own product but you have to be a member of Builder Roll if you leave Builder Roll obviously you will lose everything that uh, I give you okay because it comes in a token and the token I create a product completely dedicated to you with a website which is where you can get access to everything so hopefully you've enjoyed this this is just something to toy around with just showing you basically how to use new bard now bard is very very powerful there's loads and loads of stuff you can do with this okay gives you some great ideas you can even write a novel with bard okay it's just a very powerful powerful thing it's in exper experiment mode now okay so it's a good chance that's the reason why that other thing didn't work 
However, I've shown you how to cover yourself by actually looking for a free converter online just to put a button in. Because it's free, they're not going to worry about you doing that, okay? You're not going to get into trouble for that. Uh, and all you're doing basically is you're directing people to traffic, uh, although you're skimming off traffic through people searching for MP4 to MP3, okay? And so forth, okay? So you can see that this is another one which created um and you, you know there's loads and loads of stuff here which, which you can do okay so you know it's 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 very very clever stuff all right so hopefully that's going to give you some idea of what i was achieving for um, and you get an idea now of what we were doing okay so that's it all the very best until my next video cheers